We present BY3D, a novel stereo depth estimation approach that allows to trade depth accuracy and latency at inference time. Given an input stereo image pair, our method can detect objects that are closer than a given distance in just a few milliseconds. It can also estimate depth with arbitrary quantization and computational complexity linear with the number of quantization levels. With a larger computational budget, it can also produce a traditional depth map achieving competitive results on standard datasets. However, unlike previous methods, our approach can allocate the available computation to a specific range of interest while giving useful information for out-of-range objects. To understand how BY3D can do this, let's look at previous methods. Previous state-of-the-art approaches post stereo depth estimation as a matching problem. To solve this efficiently, these approaches take as input the stereo image pair. Then, they form a plane sweep volume. From it, they estimate a volume that stores matching costs per pixel. Let's look at a pixel Q in the cost volume. The matching cost at pixel Q is a function of disparity. These approaches estimate the costs at discrete disparity values. From these costs, they compute the probability of each candidate disparity. The disparity value with the highest probability is selected as the estimated disparity for pixel Q. This is the core principle behind previous approaches that pose stereo depth estimation as a problem of matching. State-of-the-art approaches that use deep learning to estimate cost volume achieve impressive depth estimation accuracy. However, these approaches have limitations. The very nature of this approach requires to evaluate all matching candidates to find the best match. This makes it difficult to trade accuracy for latency at inference time. For example, for faster computation, we can sample fewer and sparser disparities. After all, for use cases such as highway driving, it may be best to identify an obstacle as quickly as possible than to localize it accurately, but with higher latency. However, using sparse measurements for these methods may result in incorrect disparity estimation. On the other hand, different scenarios, such as parking, require higher depth accuracy, though possibly over smaller ranges. Sampling more finely, but only a part of the range, however, may give incorrect disparity estimation results for out-of-range objects. To tackle these limitations, we introduced BY3D, a novel learning-based stereo depth estimation approach. The core of our method is a network that takes as input any one slice of the plane sweep volume and produce a binary segmentation confidence map. A plane sweep volume slice comprises of the left image and the right image warped via 3D plane corresponding to disparity DK. The binary segmentation classifies the image into two regions, in front and beyond the plane. At any pixel Q in our confidence map, we produce the probability that the disparity at pixel Q is greater than the disparity used to warp the right image. To understand the basic intuition of our approach, consider the apparent displacement of objects as we move from the left image to the warped right image. Objects in front and beyond the plane used for warping appear to move in opposite directions. We use this change in direction to classify the pixels into two regions, in front and beyond the 3D plane. Here, on the left, we show the segmentation confidence maps as the 3D plane moves from farthest away to closer to the camera. On the right, we visualize the estimated probability that the disparity at pixel Q is greater than the disparity used to generate the binary segmentation. While traditional approaches estimate the matching probability, we propose to estimate the probability that the disparity at pixel Q is greater than D using a learning-based approach. This is the core difference between the previous approaches and ours. Let's see how our approach gives us flexibility to trade off accuracy and latency at inference time. Estimating a segmentation confidence map with respect to a single plane in the scene and thresholding it gives us a binary depth map. This gives us one bit of depth information for the entire image in a few milliseconds. We can use a sparse number of planes and generate multiple binary segmentation confidence maps. We can then combine them to produce a coarsely quantized depth without sacrificing spatial resolution. The computation required grows linearly with the number of planes and so does the number of quantization levels. 
By uniformly sampling the disparities, we can train our approach to estimate continuous depth like existing approaches and achieve competitive results on standard datasets. However, unlike previous approaches, we offer more flexibility. We can estimate depth in a specific range defined at inference time. Out-of-range objects are seamlessly estimated as lying beyond the farthest plane or in front of the closest plane. Next, we show some additional results of our approach.